question number 16 the velocity v meters per second of a particle moving in a straight line is negative 2t plus 4 meters per second determine the distance moved by the particle during the first second of its motion during the first second of its motion so we given the velocity velocity is uh, negative 2t plus 4 and uh, we require to get the distance yes. so you need to be careful you know what you're going to do you given velocity how do you get distance uh, when you're given displacement then velocity acceleration when you're moving downwards like this uh, that is uh, when you're given displacement you require to get velocity or you're given velocity you require to get velocity this downward movement you differentiate then the opposite if you're moving upwards like in this case you are moving from velocity to displacement so that one you have to integrate so you're going to integrate velocity to get distance and what do you mean by this during the first second during the first second means uh, from zero to one second this is what you mean by during the first second from zero to one second so you're going to integrate from zero to one second this expression for velocity which is negative two t plus four with respect to t so this will give a negative two squared divided by two then integrate four you get 40 plus the constant this one is from zero to one so this will give a negative t squared plus 4t plus c 0 to 1 like that so you substitute 1 when t is equals to 1 so it will be negative 1 negative 1 squared this is what I mean by negative t squared negative 1 squared let's be very careful that we put the bracket negative you just substituting t with 1 so t 1 and then plus 4 t is 1 then um, subtract when you substitute zero in this expression because you'll get zero because c will get subtracted and this will give a uh, negative one plus four negative one plus four minus zero and this will give three meters as the distance